go. All right, guys. It's what's up. It's me, War72, and um, does Walgreens sell um, Chinese video game crap? I think so, because we picked up this My Arcade Gamer V Portable 220, ready to play video games or video games. And then, of course, you're French because everybody speaks French in the United States. Um, same thing. No console required. Yeah, because it's a portable console. Take your games anywhere. That's what a portable console does. 220 video games built in. Perfect for travel and volume control. It has the selling point of, of volume rockers. And then here's your... um. Your company information. I bet it's not. That's all lies. I bet it's not in Terrence, California. I don't know what that is. I don't know. Ma manufactured in China. And I uh, can tell that these are all going to be 32 in 32 bit crappy games for for kids or for grandmas who don't know what they're buying for their kids. So on to the unboxing. If I can. Because they literally use this, probably the worst spots for tape. You have to do it like that. They could have told me in the first place. And already from the side, if you look from the side a little bit, it, you can see that it's like a, a matte finish. Even though the front of it looks glossy. So let's get that out of here. And let's open this legendary console up. And there's the piece of the hanger that just comes out <laughs> and here's the instruction manual which I bet is going to be in very poor English button functions how to use I don't think I'll need any of this oh it has a warranty and it comes in three different languages because yeah because we didn't because we don't all speak English here and just as I suspected it is glossy on the front and you don't get anything else. There's only the console and it feels very cheap. And I have to get batteries. It says playtime will vary depending on the brand of batteries used. For example, well-known battery brands tend to offer longer battery life and playtime. It's got like a rubber DOI pad that I don't really like. Your on-off switch, your rubber volume rockers. Your A and B buttons, which really feel like they're stripped right from the Wii. Select and start buttons, and then the display, which is here, but it's got the sticker over it. Let's take that off and see what it actually looks like. Oh, yeah. Look at that. It, it doesn't even fit with the display, with the module. Um, so, 